to begin that drive for the last five tracks, we are at the Petaluma Speedway for the Pit Road Panic, which has me in a panic because I am just one exhausted. And I know this track is probably going to glitch out. We're just going to have to face it head on. Let's see if we can even get off the start line. Nope, <laughs> Corey LaJoy has completely blown it. He's not the only one. Oh, Brad. Brad with a bum start. Played himself. That's tragic. That is really just something that I hate to see as we are sliding up the inside. Let me get up this dirt embankment. That is always one of the harder things to achieve. Sometimes I'm just getting packed in from behind. Victimized right in the victim, in victimized, and you bums are not gonna be able to get through there, are you? You wastes. Look at the intelligence that is performing in front of you right now. I, I mean, we might get through this actually. Look at this, it's a team effort. This isn't, me getting hooked is not. Jeff Burton has just said, I will get through here regardless. And look at you, Jeff, how did it work out? Not well. The answer is not well. This pack up here is just asking for trouble. Somebody's about to get stuffed. I can feel it. There's a, oh, it's me. It was me all along. Oh, damn it. I've been played by myself. And this is just really an atrocious sight. Let me see if I can somehow scrape some dignity off the floor. As we're gaining some spots back up to six. What is Phil Parsons doing? Get a grip, friend. Oh, great. Oh, and we get stuffed again. Coming back the other way. Just up uh, right into the face of Ricky Stenhouse. After taking one to the face from Grand Infinger. It's just nothing but face stuffers over here. I got to reset. We're just so discombobulated. My car is in shambles. We're not even one lap into this thing. I'm flipping over trailers. I lost the wheel. Only I can lose a wheel on an object that's just planted there like a trailer. This is definitely another point for Ed Stradamus, though, with the glitchiness of this track. We saw it coming. Brad Keselowski didn't even get off the line. He's going to cause a pile up back there. My trunk has been mangled. Oh, and I'm going to spit it out. This thing's going to perform well now, isn't it? Right from the get-go. My trunk reduced to atoms from the tiniest of taps victimized once again i can't believe it and this is gonna be fun to try to fight through excuse me bubba please all oh, run underneath justin Haley, and we've been packed i refuse to accept this i refuse to take this fate i'm out of here oh we got synchronized jumping going on can we find a gap i think we just might sneak through here yes we do oh that's gonna become a hazardous zone be, be careful everybody oh we got a track block aj and phil out of the way Who's that? Coy Joy. Just send it, brother. I respect it. Well, let's complete a lap here. How about that? Oh, we might not. We might not complete a lap. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. Oh, we were in the lead. What in the world? That is the lead that just passes by again. Oh, and they just destroyed themselves. Somebody just took themselves out of the park. Right off the side, and I almost crashed into it looking at it. We're gonna hunt down Derek Cross. I believe that's him right up here in front of us. And of course, we're gonna get roadblocked here by a bunch of cars. Greg, if you could get out of the way, that's not what they mean by stick with the Biff. Bubba Wallace says stick with this. And it indeed stuck. Oh, who's this guy? Ron Bouchard with the barrel roll. We just go right into him then we get jumped over by Jeremy Clements. What a move, five stars. X Games mode. We can keep it in sending distance of Kraus. We'll have no choice. Oh, he sent it. He sent it into overdrive. Lick the stamp and send it. And it was returned to the sender. And Ron Bouchard's in our way again. The human roadblock strikes again. He's still holding me up, this guy. I, my wheel comes off with the slightest of taps. This car is indestructible until it isn't. We literally just need to crawl to the line and we will win this race. Oh, for Christ, the people that are actually having a chance to win this from me are busy wrecking themselves and Grant's holding me back. My wheels won't spin. I'm gonna lose this race because of this. My three wheel jalopy has cost me a dub. I can't even get up the ramp. I can't even get up the ramp. What an absolutely sorry disgrace and i am i gonna get shoved over the line i am somebody had pity on me i think it was ross chastain thank you melon man what a joke 
I also love starting six miles from the start line and getting packed right from the get-go of the race and not even be able to get onto the track. Right through the funnel we go. What a smoothie of stupidity this has become. We have about six brain cells between this whole pile. The wheel spin city. I want to get a nice little push there. See, that push actually helped me up, but I'm on the outside now. You got me right in the victim. My slow go too. That's almost too fitting. We somehow push our way through all of that. I can't believe it. There, Krause laying in the road. How the mighty have fallen. We went from battling to the lead to barely hanging on to the top 10, and we're going to miss the wide open gap. How do we manage that? Somehow parked it in the wall instead. Oh my God, Buddy Baker got it all wrong. And I'm going to miss the corner looking at it. Just a disastrous attempt at a landing from Buddy Baker. We're going to shove Justin Haley out of the way. Probably just hindered ourselves more than anything. But can we get down here smoothly? Oh my God, no, we cannot. Just an uppercut full of vitriol from Neil Bonnet and he turtled. Oh, what the hell, Jeff Burton out of the bushes in a camo car. This guy just came at me with a ghillie suit on or something. Oh, and the Biff, the atomic leg drop on the Biff sends us into a series of flips and we're going to climb our way back into this fight somehow again. Oh, where did this guy go? Oh, he went to the trailers. Where are you going? He faced through one and then hit a solid smaller one. And that puts us on the podium. And then I immediately dump it on the landing. Oh, we're going to pull it into the line of fire there. Brad Keselowski spares me. Somebody else is not. It drops it right in my ass. Was that Clements? What a sentence. Oh, my God. What an explosion of cars from the depths. And that has put us on track to catch the leader, and we are about to catch the... Oh, Eric Elbrow is hanging out in the bushes as well. No, and Betty Parson is going to capitalize. He's taking the lead. I won't stand for this. Oh, the road's blocked. The road is entirely blocked. Oh, come on. We want to do this legit, but there's going to be a massive pile up. Clements has lost the wheel. Packed me. Sacrificed himself. I don't know if we'll be able to get through this without resetting, but I at least want to try. We got to do this the, the hard way. Oh, come on. I can't even get this car to move. Come on. This is it right here. Let me through. Oh, that just, what an abysmal failure. Well, you know what? We tried. People kind of died. We'll limp it across the line and collect dub number 21, and we might uh, get our trailer and get the heck out of here as fast as possible. Well, looks like we'll be putting our Space Force tactics and training to the test here as we roll into Rainbow Road in space. Yeah. And we are off and underway in a galaxy near you, and we already packed somebody. So good to know that packing in space is still an option. I thought about turning on moon gravity, but I figured jumps like that one right there would end disastrously for everyone and probably end the race prematurely. We've gotten up to the top 10 prematurely here. We are cooking as we get packed a little bit and sent into the corner. That's going to cause us to dump a few guys. They got hit with the shells early. Oh, we got them setting it up here. This is a deceptive corner. That's right. We got to slow it down big time, but not enough. Ripping a wheel off and we're getting wadded up into a ball of trash at the side of the road. And more of them are coming at us, it looks like. Oh, and they barely miss us. It's the big one. Safely get down the hill without mid-air collisions, or we can just do the exact opposite. Please don't fall into space. Please don't fall into space. I think we lived. I think we're okay. <laughs> it's just teeter-tottering on the corner, getting swept up by the oncoming cars. I think we'll live. Side by side is a bold move up there. Oh, I can't even go through here by myself, apparently. We're back in the wall. We drive clean underneath Ned Jarrett. Launched him. Need a tire right now, too, as we're collecting spots. We've got a roadblock of Logano in front of us. And Dale. <laughs> we're pushing Dale out of the way so we can get through. We are the track cleaning crew. Who would have thought? And another one. Slide and knocking him out of the way. Oh, and that's going to end in a hit. And my car won't drive. Come on, car. There we go. Now the guy goes back on my outside. 
Can I force him to run into one of these cars? Is he gonna do it on his own? Yes, kind of. Side by side still. Sliced bread himself giving us our money's worth. And we're gonna complete the pass off the corner. How about that? Oh, oh, oh no. Watch out, Tim Richmond. I take it you made the same mistake I did, partner. This is a vulnerable position that we are in, and I'm dead. I am dead in space. Get a move on, Jeremy. Come on, Jeremy. You can do it. One of these days, Jeremy Clements is going to figure it out, and it's going to be an unbelievable celebration. Remember that time in Road America? You figured it out while well, you forgot again. We are not forgotten how to gain spots. Look at this set. Oh, I did not. I've not braked appropriately. It may not matter. Holes are opening up. We're bouncing our way through. Red Byron's trying to take Jimmy Spencer and us down. He succeeds. Oh, and then we get atomically packed by Christopher Bell. And Harrison's going to help me out. He's going to straighten me back up. Only for me to be turned right back around again. And it was Swerving Irvin who did the work. Oh, no. This corner's going to catch me out again. There it is. Planted it in the wall. Still all right. Oh, we might not be all right now. We're going to get a massive pack. We're definitely not all right. And we're going to go fly it through space. Uh, they want you to look over towards the dark side of the Earth. It should be cresting the horizon about 15 degrees east of the starboard PV rays. There it is. We're getting your feet, Sat One. Come in, Houston. Uh, are you getting this? Sat One, keep tracking the bogey. We're looking into it. Stand by. Houston, this is ISS. <laughs> to minimize the amount of space excursions taking place, if at all possible, as we race down into turn one, and the turn one meme does pretty much apply to this one. It is fair, it's fair game. Oh, Dale Sr., is he going to intimidate his way through the pack? Oh, I might intimidate him out of the way, and we do. Bullied. And Mario Andretti says, you will never do this to Dale, and he absolutely puts me down where I belong. Comes the corner of doom. Brandon Brown says, see you later. I'm going to send it, and I have no choice in the matter. I get packed from behind. And we have got a massive one to make our way through, and we do unscathed. And then we, uh, and then we pack Bubba Walls directly in the ass. But besides that... What a beautiful example of wreck avoidance. So we might pick up a couple more spots here as we make our way up the loop here. This is really turned into a loop. We got three spots, three wide. Come on, can I get a fourth? Let me get Jimmy Spencer out of my way. We're just going to pack him right up the backside. Oh, and he gets set, and Bubba's into me again. We're going to somehow come out of this on the podium. And can we fight off this attack? We can. We're going to complete a lap here unprecedented untouched territory this is a monster send down the ramp and i deserve this please no i've fallen through space enough today for once we're gonna land it not cleanly but enough to survive and we'll lose a spot but hopefully there will be drama that'll keep us in it oh look at that i learned i finally learned and look at all these fools who did not in fact, we are going to take the lead as they are wadded up. Oh, just a conga line of cars, and they're not going anywhere. What are you buffoons doing? And out of the final corner, we may be reigning supreme once again. If we could dodge a shell from whoever this is, it's Danica. But she leaves us be, spares us for another day, and we will come across the line and score another victory in our quest for dubs number 22 and into the replay booth we come here because this little corner and stretch of road here at rainbow road proved to be quite a little disaster area as cars are flipping piling up crashing and we're gonna scoot right along through a gap and find our way through it as the rest of them all smash each other up in the back well welcome back to earth everybody as we return to Norway here for race 23 Lingus and its original reverse layout here because I believe that was one of the best if not the best layouts that were available back when we ran this track for the trials and it does have a danger zone so we got to watch out for it 
Off we go. Four wide at the start. Always going to be a bit scary. And it's getting squeezed tastic right from the start. We're packing Cole Custer right from the get go. And still getting squeezed. We're going to go in the grass through the signage. And get back on the road. Oh my God, what a ride for Steve Park. How on brand is that as we get whacked from behind? We're going to have to just reset this one and try to gather it up. Oh, we're going to reset. Oh, we phased in at the exact wrong time. And we're just gonna reverse our way out of the shame and or at least try to. I'm gonna reverse into the road and into the path of traffic. This is just gonna get worse. Is somebody gonna knock me back going in the right direction? They were looking like they were going to. Now they've knocked me off the road entirely. They've disposed of me like trash. Natalie, please. Oh, she did. She gave me the spot. We get the corner. They all send it and wreck it. What a maneuver by us to get to the podium. Oh, that's gonna get taken from us right away in the front two have wrecked themselves they've been annihilated and austin hill leaves us with nowhere to go and we have been swallowed up oh no why why austin austin dylan treating me like eric almarola i cannot believe this oh and then there he goes it has not paid off we have to send it for bobby though we got to get our podium back for it oh no and we've blown it what a disgrace our hopes and dreams shattered. We land on our side. Bubble Wallace, a lap down, gives me a smack that I very much deserve. We lose our fourth place spot even to Danica Patrick and we're gonna fall back to fifth. What a shame. Tire check, get your tires here right from the start and we pack Terry Nadu up and dump them. And we're not done, we're gonna dump Juan Pablo Montoya as well. Jet dryer, check. Ass check for me, getting packed mine. We're gonna wreck bending inside. Oh, well, mega pack to Bubba. And we have been escorted from the track. Looks like a bunch of guys missed the corner up here. Oh, they're backing it up into the lane. Oh, and we're gonna get the cease to part for us perfectly. That was beautiful. This is brave, and there it is. Jeff Burton just takes him out. The seven time champ stood no chance. Oh, he's going back for him. He just went and got him back. A Jeff Burton, Jimmy Johnson rivalry may be breaking out in front of our eyes, and then the ambulance just knocks me out of the lane. They are definitely losing time. They have indeed crashed. Look at us gaining spots into the top five. Oh, what is this track cut right there? Give me the spots. I'll take the third. Oh, is it? There it is. There's a move right there. And Jerry Nadu got dumped by a lapper, and then Jimmy Johnson out of nowhere rolls me. Jimmy, you betrayed me. Ah, yes, just drive clean through me, Greg Golding. That was a masterful move, and Greg Sachs as well. Just magnificent. Send it deep. Get in there. Oh, somebody missed it up there. Second place missed the corner entirely. Jerry Nadu has won. Oh, and then Greg Sachs is losing it. Is he going to dump it right before the line? He did. Oh, what a bunch of bums. They all just handed me second. We get a clean start here. Oh, no, not if we get underneath Jeff Burton any deeper than that. Bubba will straighten you out, maybe, potentially, yes. Blaney, give me some space. And Steve Park, we're caught in the middle of a sandwich here. For sure. Oh, man, people getting tired, checked and wrecked all in front of us. Can we please just keep our car pointed in the right direction? Somehow we're falling out of all of it. Chase Elliott trying desperately to wreck. He finally does. I'm just going to hold it on the outside here. Hope for life. I just want to hope for survival, and I'm not going to get it. Brett Bodine out in front of me, snipes us, and has now just claimed us as his own. Oh, Ryan Sieg with a big boy run on our inside to the corner, and that is going to allow him to slam us out of the way and take a couple of spots. Oh, we get caught up on the curb. No. Reset it. Slam the reset. Get me going here. We can't go out like that. We got to find Ryan Sieg after that. That was a bold strategy. Austin Hill coming in for the tap. Come on, where is he at? We just passed Chase Elliott again. Let's see who we can, oh, somebody, did Denny Hamlin just wrecked himself out of the park, it looked like. And we're making our way up the field. Oh, we got violence breaking down in front of us here. Great, Bubba. Separate it, sort it out, boys. You can do it. Oh, we got, oh, we got a roadblock coming up in front of us there, and somebody's gone into a barrel roll. Oh my God, Ryan Blaney's gonna carry us. Like a chariot to victory, maybe? Not quite, but we're close. We're on the podium. Get it going. Oh, we're not on the podium anymore, but we're close. The fight is right here, and Jeff Burton's going to take us out of it, maybe. He's hindering us. Let's see. We'll get by Greg Galding back on the podium. We go. Norm Benning is in the lead, and Danica Patrick has taken it. Now it's 
Danica Patrick, Gray Golding, and then us. Come on, we gotta send it. This has to be it. Look at this finish. Gray Golding and Danica Patrick fighting for this win. I said it, it was not enough. Danica loses out, Gray Golding takes the win. What an unbelievable finish. Not only did we have a spectacular finish, we had all kinds of crazy happenings here at the start finish line. This camera will provide us with all of the action, but maybe one of the greatest finishes that we've had in a long time. Here it comes at us right here. Danica Patrick got sent by Greg Golding and he sneaks it in there right at the end. Lesson learned, we need to channel our inner Greg Golding here. Maybe they're the first corner, but Jeff Burton's trying to stop us once again. And now we're getting picked up by Greg Sachs from behind. Nobody's helping me in this scenario right here. Nothing about the situation is good. There goes Derry Nadu. He will not be winning this one. The seven time champ is gonna go plowing into Hamlin. And the beat carries on, but not us. We get dumped. Oh no, and that has got us back in. Oh, I was gonna say 15th, and then we lose another three spots. To 18th we go. We gotta crawl it back, get it back in the right direction without getting slammed by every single car lower than 15th like we just were. That was unbelievable tire check. Oh, a set, oh, oh, oh. Greg Sachs tried it and risked it all right there and nearly got our life. Holy crap, I just saw everything I've ever worked for flash before my eyes. That, that was scary. That was actually terrifying. Norm Benning sideways in the middle of the track's not too good either. Ryan Seeks taking himself out of the fight. He just beached himself as we begin the last lab in the hunt. For Mr. JPM, the Formula F1 driver's Chase Elliott has beached himself. And JPM, oh, Juan has lost all time. He's frolicking out in the flowers. Oh, and we're gonna go as well. We have launched it. Dukes of Hazard style. Get me on the track, please. Let's go. Oh, no, I'm stuck. Reset. Reset. Our back bumper really defines our race as Bobby Allison just doing donuts in the corner there. Somebody missed the corner back there. Another, the seven time champ doing donuts over here. That is very interesting. Maybe they're celebrating what could be our dub, our 23rd dub, as we slide it around the last corner. Should we just cruise it in with absolute disrespect to Juan Pablo Montoya? He was starting to close in on us. We capture the victory. Well, we are here for the penultimate race at the Wild West Motorsports Park for the classic tube of love off we go oh, already getting a few tippy taps off the start but those of you who remember our previous adventures here at this track will know that this one is a brutal one it is a grinder of cars and right into the first corner the turn one meme proves that to be the case in point we're already on our lid here so that has proved it entirely until i get saved right there and we'll carry on with a few dings and right along into the next reg that's about five feet up the road we'll force our way back in line Bully a couple of cars. We got bully ball forming out here. Bully car. And Robbie's getting that entire quarter panel full of it right now. And he might get another one here into this corner. And he is in indeed as he goes into a barrel roll. And he saved it. He rolled right out of it. We might get sent too, but it's Ricky Rudd who goes. Holy shrimp. The pink and white car with a Dale Sr. Just went to the moon and came down and rained down upon the field with fury a shrimp from the sky that's one of the most remarkable things i've ever seen in wreckfest and we're knocking vickers up and out of the way almost but he just carries on like nothing even happened we're going up the wall we're scaling the wall sending it oh we almost got around there clean but clements gets knocked out of the way just a tad and we get through with the greatest of ease. What a send up top. We might lose a wheel doing that. I have to be really careful as Harrison Burton gets sent. On John Hunter, Nima check. Let me do a little Cole Custer move on you. Get your right out of the way. Oh no, he's mounted me. And we have caught for a bit of a, I don't know what you would call an intent. Would you call that an entanglement? GG Zankrum. We're gonna send it up the wall. We snatched that last spot from Kurt Busch. We might. Oh, unless we wreck it in the last straight. Come on, power through it. We got a corpse laying in the road. Get out of the way. We're going to slam it. Reverse across the line. And we're going to get nailed as we finish in the fourth position. Oh, 
Back into the replay booth to look at our man, Dale Earnhardt. Look at this. He goes up the tube and comes crashing down on top of the field. And he'll be happy to have had the Earnhardt bar right there. Wish me for better luck here on the outside as we've already climbed up Stuart Friesen and he goes all the way to the top floor. And we drop down on our head and get it caved in and we are beached on top of a couple of cars. We're free. Our Cal Petty up here at Michael and Nett. Oh, sliding doors against each other. No big deal. It's just the natural greeting here in Wreckfest as you pass another car. There goes Kyle Petty. Speaking of him, he's gone and Todd Gillen might go too, but we save it. Oh, this is going to be a tight three wide pass up the middle. Was it ever as we just blast the car out of the way. Now that's how I like to make my passes. That is straight out of the end sound head school of Tom Foolery behind the wheel. And speaking of which, here's some more. Todd Gillen takes his shot and he lands every inch of it. And he's not the only one who's going to, as we're now just going to complete some more on this racetrack in reverse. We are a professional reverse racer or not. Kyle Petty really letting it all hang out. Brian Vickers trying to get back to my bumper. Kevin Harvick back from getting blasted. Is he trying to get himself hooked? Yes, he is, and he is successful. There it went. And nothing of value was lost. Just hopes and dreams ripped to shreds. Send it into the corner. That is a brutal hit against the wall in the front end of my car. It's gone. It's missing. Put it on a milk carton. It is gone. And I'm gonna get, am I gonna get carried to the line by people who don't know how to turn the wheel slightly to one side or the other? And all of this could be completely avoided. Well, they finally pushed their way by, but it's not gonna end there as we get lit up by Clements. And finally, just before the finish line, of course, somebody picks us off. We get to that inside lane. Oh, now before we pack Kyle Petty into the corner, we're gonna get sent. Oh, we torpedo our way into the first corner. Kyle Petty got launched. And the turn one meme and living strong. Oh, can we make our, oh, can we jump it? No. The answer was no. That looked like an Antonio Brown hurdle. That just ended up being a kick in the face. And that better not have been one of my wheels. Uh, and it was. And there, all right, there it is. Even Wreckfest is like, just just end this already, will you, please? Our best bet is definitely just to rally along this left side wall and just hopefully Kyle give us a little bit of space here. Him and Dale. Oh, and I'm gonna get hooked into Dale, I'm sorry. Not Dale. We gotta set it up the wall though. There we go. There we go. We'll make up spot looking to seventh. Oh, it all went to plan until like piggybacked on Harrison Burton here. We're free. Oh, he's gonna get sideways in front of us all. We avoided. That was professional. Oh, that was military grade, and we are getting even further up the field. Look at this send job, and I'm just, st I stuck the biff. Oh, my word, and I've blown it. No. Land, land on your wheels, will you? Rusty, don't do this to me. If anybody hits me, it is over for you. Anything, any of your hopes and dreams, who are you? Who done this? BJ McLeod, it's over for you, pal. You better hope I don't win this race. I've got places to be in a run out of the corner. John or Nemechek is blocking me, though. Come on, I got a run coming right here into the corner. Send it. It's my destiny to send it. They all get stacked up. Oh, I'm going to send it back into the side of Rusty. Come on, Rusty. Don't play with me right now. I am not one to be put to the test. Come on. Give me that run past Tyler Ingram. Let me clear him, and we will have the lead. We are in it. Final lap. Final first corner send. Don't want to. Oh, my car's falling apart. My car's disintegrating. No, don't do this to me. We're three wheeling it. I think we can live though. Come on. Oh, we got that. We got a lucky bounce there. We've got less than a second. It's gained. We're, oh, we're pulling away. We're going to do it. We're going to get to the line smoothly and cleanly with a absolutely mangled car, but we got a dump. Well, can you believe it? A journey unlike any other in its grueling nature has come down to this and good god what on earth is happening and off we go for the final track in the gauntlet 2.0 Blaney out to a start Haley digging as well they meet in the middle and collide for the lead Blaney continues on we get to second is everybody else? oh Deegan crosses us under we get some collision between the front runners here we'll send it on Deegan collide meet in the middle up to the wall 
and they slide back underneath me perfectly. How grand is that? Is there's gonna be an intersection in and we get popped up and flipped. And we're gonna land on the wheels there. Counted as a 10 and some hits in the intersection behind us. Oh, and in front of us, tire check. Tires laying everywhere now and more intersection hits. That'll gain us a couple spots, get us into the top five. We gotta miss some boys. To find the path, we got cars sliding everywhere. Bubba, oh, we get smashed. Just annihilate. Oh, we got more cars coming at us and they get hit and we get victimized from behind by everyone. That was a massive, gnarly hit. We nearly take Davey Allison out of the race, just trying to get turned around here. We might get him, there he goes. Taking out of our aggression on innocent drivers now. Oh, he's, he's from the grave, he's blocking me in this guy. Gonna line it up here, but we're gonna miss him. And Ryan Blaney will take the double. Oh, we're gonna take a hit from Tim Richmond and we deal one out to Casey Mears. He drops it back on us. He got Space Force. Anyone else, y'all got one more chance to mop me up and you failed. You have all failed miserably, as did I at winning this race. And we pack another man after the race is over to seven. See if we can get a nice high above angle of us getting blasted in the intersection from one of the nice signs above the track. Time number two, Blaney giving the shove. This time is there like four wide for the lead and we can dump and save it. And we're alive. This intersection's gonna get hot right here and it is indeed. Popping off. Oh, and then Brad Keselowski out of nowhere. Brad, where did you come from, my boy? You can't be doing this to us. This is gonna scow us. I couldn't even get the sentence out. Couldn't even form words. It was just fear. Just pure, raw fear. Oh, is this gonna be another one? No, it's, yes it is. I knew it. I knew it. I thought we were in the clear, but he was just there. Oh, Elliot, and there is a massive intersection hit into the tires. And then the most popular driver gets packed by Clearman. We've got Truex behind us, man, packing us up the hill as well. And back into the intersection, we go for more heat and back into the tires. We go in more hits and they keep on coming from every direction. Oh my, this is getting brutal towards the end of the line here. Got a bunch of them wrecked up here. We'll go low. Oh, we gotta keep, oh, we didn't go low enough. But we went right into the door of Stenhouse. Uh, just get throw oh, mirrors backing it up into my lane. And once again, I've been put into a reverse act and I'm stuck. Come on. Oh no, this is not the help I need. This is not, oh, maybe it is actually. Oh, Rusty. Rusty, you are very inconveniently placed, my friend. Come on, I'll dash to the line. It's gonna be a drag race. And we just, I believe, brushed into seven there at the end. Tell you what, I'm done giving these guys wasted pushes into the first corner. We're just gonna slide job them up smoothly to the lead. Every time this right, if I don't get hit, I'll get hit from every side. And in the intersection by cars behind me, we've got cars flipping all over the place. We need to get out of here. Mears has been through a lot today. Oh, this is gonna be a split. We didn't quite make it. Oh, that was close. And then Brad tags me on the way by. Oh, we got one getting tire checked hard and big, and we are holy matrix mode. Did we ever get through that? Trouble ahead. We might have to make a four wide pass here. Oh, it's not gonna quite work out. As we got launched by Bobby Allison into a twister. Punch up. Oh, yep. Yeah, you can just tell that coming on the mini map, couldn't you? And good God, help me get out of the way, please. Thank you. Definitely hurting in the corner, swipe the wall. Can we get through these last two without getting hit? Oh, we'll get hit from behind. We don't even have to worry about getting nailed in the intersection as Casey Mears takes the dub. Can we collect second place and we get through clean cars coming at us from the other side of the track, but it won't matter. We come home just short in second. We just gotta send it straight through the middle. We're like seven wide. We gotta do what we can here. Oh my God, look at the huge one break out behind us. We gotta take it to the wall. Oh, the intersection is gonna get hot. The leader just got taken out. Haley Deegan takes the lead. Can we take it from her? Yes, we can. And we're in it. Oh, no, yep. Man, that was a brutal hit for Clint Boyer right there. Just took that thing straight to the side, as does whoever that was. I don't even have a clue. 
Ryan Vickers, wow, he, there he is. He strikes right there. Oh, and then we get massively collected in the intersection to our demise. We got to bust out the replay for some of these. That was one of the unholiest endings to a race, and it didn't even start there. There was plenty of action in the intersection beforehand. Then you have us coming out of the corner. Vickers gives us a tap, lines us up perfectly for the kill, and man, was it ever a brutal one. Let's see if we can get the run off the corner. Blaney comes up, knocks himself out of contention. Nice job. Ooh, mini map showing me a close one here. Kligerman, and he just catches the end of me. I hate this. Oh, this keeps happening. They keep catching just the very tip. Too much corner right there. Oh, that's an inconveniently placed Rusty. Another inconvenient. Oh, if I had been real, that would have hurt. Oh, this is cut off. Make up for that one we missed earlier. And then he comes and flies back into me. Added insult to injury. Casey Mears with another win and a few more domino hits at the end that are completely unnecessary. And another runner up finish for me to go home and cry it. Detecting 0% chance survivability, and indeed it's a train. Just a freight train coming through and more as cars continue to get blasted. It's like we're in the clear here. Oh, but Haley's gonna pull it out in front of us and gets packed and we, oh, is it gonna make us reset for that? It is. That is tragic right there. Justin, why'd you do this to me? Oh God, Truex just pounds me right in the door and I reverse it into nowhere. Oh, we're setting up for the double and it's a big one. And we drop the hammer on Todd Gilliland and Stenhouse and I get a vicious T-bone in the door. But we're still alive somehow. Bobby Allison rides up and rolls over the side of us and just is running us down. What are you doing to me, Bob? Bobby? Good God, Bobby, get off of me. There's, there's children watching for Christ's sake. That was appalling what I just saw. Get me to the finish line before we have to ask too many questions about what just happened. I think I need a bleach bath. Hope through the Leo Blaney up the hill and gonna mount us, gets himself turned and we flip another car over into a wild set. Casey Mears gets a shot. Can we cross the lane? We do. Oh, Brad Keselowski with the takedown on me. No, Brad, you can't do this to me now. And that breathing down my neck and he hits me and he knocked me through the gap and we're gonna go through a gap in the wall. And we're gonna wind up in the parking lot. It looks like we're gonna drive downtown a medical center here. I need a mental evaluation as to why I'm still doing this. Hit me up, doc. Oh, they're hooking me the wrong way into the crowd. Brandon Jones getting hooked and tipped into the field and somehow we still come out in the podium. We're in third. Oh God, yep. Well, you could see that coming from about 1500 centuries ago. <laughs> and still some more in the next one. We got guys pirouetting over here in the corner. Brandon Jones again. Slide jobbing our way up here in the seventh. Can we get through this intersection? Absolutely not Ryan Truex and I have gone for a tumble and I have just I hope I impressed the judges with that one. Oh, another one, unbelievable. It's literally my destiny to get caught up in these. It is actually my true fate. Can we even complete a lap at this point? No, we cannot. This is actually becoming a sick, cruel, and unusual joke. Sindra came out of nowhere. Absolutely creamed us. Speaking of which, there goes the wheel. Oh, and here comes another hit for the ages to line it up on me. I'm a victim once more. Oh, there you go. We're getting playing a super push in the middle of the corner. He can't even turn. Oh, and clear. We're getting sandwiched. Come on. Oh, somebody did a wheelie up there on the high side. That was kind of sick, buddy Baker. Shout out to you. I saw you. Oh, tire check in the intersection. It's getting clogged up and crazy. And there it is. Truex gets shoved into the blender in the intersection. We take some shots from the field. And we're going to barely hang on to the top 10. It looks like we can hold off Casey Mears behind as he gets held up. We got them wrecking each other here in front of us, bouncing off the walls. Jimmy Spencer get the crying tower. Oh, my God. We just got the roof caved in. F in the chat for anybody in the back seat. It's like they're riling it up, but everybody's got... Oh, what a shot. 
Oh, I don't have the back end of a car anymore. <laughs> it looks fine from that angle, and then you just pan over. It's gone. Wait, you can give me this inside. Thank you, Blaney. Got a little tap, but not much. It will slide job. Our way to the lead once again. Tire check out of the corner. Another familiar sight, as well as getting creamed. That should be expected. Just slam the reset. Still in the lead. Final lap is underway. I don't want to jinx it, but if this is it, this has been the cleanest race of all time to end it on. What a way that would be to end the gauntlet. But my God, come on. We've got a couple more intersections to go. We should really be shutting up. I don't want to jinx this thing before it's over. We got a clear one here. Two more to go. Could this be it? This, I, I feel, I'm shaking a little bit right now. I'm scared. Donuts are being done by Casey Mears. In the final corner, the 25 race gauntlet 2.0 is coming to an end. We slide it across the line. We take the 25th and final dub. Well, ladies and gentlemen, what can you possibly say after completing a journey like we just have? 25 races, 25 dubs, countless crashes, ass packs, tire checks, space forcing, you name it. We explored it to the depths and took on 25 of the greatest tracks Wreckfest has to offer, either through the game itself or through the fantastic modding community. We conquered it all. And it only took us, according to my calculations, as I sit here at this computer today, 11 and a half hours of recorded footage to record the Wreckfest Gauntlet 2.0. God help me when it comes to editing this thing. It's gonna have to be in parts, I would imagine. And it's probably gonna take some time, but by the time you're hearing this, it'll be done. So congratulations to you for making it all the way through. If you did, if you marathoned it like a maniac or whether you just watched this part, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you'll stick around for whatever future episodes we do. Because while I'm sure a lot of people are already ready to ask me if we're gonna do a gauntlet episode for 300, I don't know. I'm not committing to it because this was a monumental pain in the ass. So with that, I think it's about time we sign off of this godforsaken gauntlet and we enjoy the rest of our freedom at a later date and time. So thank you everybody once again so much for watching. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you have not already, all that stuff helps us out more than you could possibly imagine. But you guys joining us on this adventure was help enough, believe me. Thank you, everybody, so much. And with that, I will see you in the next one. Peace.